Hello everyone and welcome back to the long dark. Let's jump back and here we are. Okay, yes, we uh, saved up in a car. All right, the sun, ooh, that's a lot of crows. Okay, the sun is in fact up. Yep, I, uh, yep, tank over the wolf right there, didn't I? Okay, let me uh, just check my buck puck. Actually, not yet. Uh, I am parched and a bit peckish. So I just need to drink some water. Three pounds. Taking up all my backpacks, but. Alright. Looks like the wolves have subsided. That's a good thing. But I can't believe I didn't get them. I wanted to eat them. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's dead wolf. Yeah. Dead wolf. Frozen. Damn it. Let's uh, warm you up a bit. Let's see. Campfires. Camp. And. Well done. Okay, right here, I guess. And we will, of course, light it with a torch. It's very effective lighting a fire with a torch. I really don't even see why I have to go through this process. It should just be like bam, here's a fire because you already have burning wood. I, I just, did it. I just noticed that the crows actually marked the wolf carcass that I killed. They used to not do that. Okay, now he's only 93% frozen. 92% frozen. 92. Oh. Alright, and now we can throw the extra sticks on there. Perfect. Now I got plenty of time. Now let's quarter this thing. I want to find out what quartering does. It might be handy later. Okay, fire is out. But it is now quartered. It did! Could end up being useful. Wolf quarter. Section of a wolf carcass cut into... Cut from the carcass to make transportation a bit easier. Harvest for usable meat. Okay, sweet. Um, what about the legs? Okay, so the legs are useless. Good, 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 good. Okay, so that's what quartering does. It just it allows you to take the carcass with you. The rabbits, I could already do that because they're rabbits. Oh, sweet. Nothing like finding cedar wood in a truck. Alright, now, this guy should have some beef jerky. Ooh, does this radio work? Nope. This guy should have some beef jerky. Ah, oh, he already ate his beef jerky. I have a can of peaches. Ooh. Low volume fuel source designed to help start fires, etc. Lighter fluid. Sauté na. That'll help in a pinch. But can I actually refuel a lighter with it? Better be some beef jerky in the glove box and be very pissed off. Oh, I am so pissed off. People not having food for my apocalyptic survival. Cars. Okay, I should probably collect some firewood because uh, it's snowing pretty pretty good out here, and uh, firewood would be benefit. I'm not about to go underneath the bridge just yet. I might come back to that, but right now I need to find some way to get out of this damn snow. But I also need to ever move onward. So that's the problem with this game. You want to camp out. But you kind of can't stay in one spot for too long. Attracts animals, you use up your supplies in that area, and you have to move on. It's just... Now, I know it seems kind of like I'm having to stop every five minutes for fire. That's because I am. Uh, the cars are good, but the cars don't really provide anything as far as work goes other than wind resistance. Risha mushroom. Definitely collect these mushrooms. Goddamn freezing. Ah, I'm at risk for hypothermia. Okay, good thing I came down here. What's this? Fur? Oh yes, it's firewood. And I think I'll uh I think I'll build a fire here, collect all these sticks, and warm up a bit. Okay, so yeah, this this is a little heavier. But it made it where it didn't take so much time actually getting it done. But while I'm warming up, I might as well go ahead and harvest it out. So quartering it is good if you don't have the time to 
like harvest it up right then. But now I have time to harvest it up, so here we are. All righty, righty. My stats are back up. Everything's doing fine now. I don't H. Thank you for that. I was wondering how to do that very thing. The chick stopped leaving me bits of cloth, so I'm just kind of lost. I should probably just follow the damn road. That's just probably what the game wants me to do. But you never know. Like, what if you go left when you should have went right? Gotta be careful. And this snowstorm picking up. This isn't good. It's turning nighttime too, which means it's gonna get even colder. Got a rock, I'm not afraid to use it. Rabbit. Rabbit, rabbit. God damn you, rabbit. Oh, sheesh, why don't you just run so far away that I don't even see you anymore? Hey, ya <coughs> Yes, yes. Run, what are you doing? Run! Damn it! Gotta be fast on that. What's up, little rabbit? Bye bye, rabbit. Okay, got some food for it. Ooh, much bigger. Can I stun him with a rook? Doubt it. And I am gonna try. I'm just gonna leave him to his thing. Ooh, what is that? In a world full of blue and white and black. Seen orange. Not sure why I feel so tired. It's good. Apparently, I am super tired. Oh, yes, I want to go down there. I should have followed the damn road because now I'm on a freaking hill. Don't break an ankle. Don't break it. Don't break an ankle. Eh, eh. Made it, Porter John. Why can I not go in the Porter Johns? All right, sweet. I found a little area with deer. Even better for those with bucks. Gotta be careful with those guys. All right, what is this thing? This is nothing. It's obviously it's put here by the developers to say, hey, why don't you come over here? <laughs> Carter Hydro Energy. That's the dam. There's a place in this game called the Carter Hydroelectric Dam. So, apparently they work here. A fire barrel. That'll protect the fire from the wind. Alright, now I'm overweight, so I gotta be careful. I can barely sleep shit in here. Broken metal, need a hacksaw. Broken metal door. Right. A jerry can. Ooh. Could be useful. An old metal jerry can containing fuel for oil lamps and fire accelerant. I can barely say it. Ooh, bottle of water, I'll take that. Cargo pants, I'll take that. Wonder if this is any good to Moldy eat. Moldy beef jerky. Water purification tablets. A packet of water purification tablets can help prevent dysentery. One tablet treats one liter of non potable water. Well, I boil my water, so no, I won't be doing that. Although it does allow you to purify water without a fire. So that's good. Alright, let's get back to exploring. If I explore really far out, I might not come back. I might just camp up somewhere, but, you know, I gotta find a campsite first. My guy is just all kind of overweight and moving slow and very tired, so I should probably stop collecting stuff. But it's like I have to collect the stuff. Okay, I'm not going to collect any more sticks. I know they're everywhere, but I, I'm too overweight. It's kind of funny. The more tired you are, the less you can carry. But the more you're overweight, the more tired you become for moving. All right, the road's down there. So I'm technically still following the road. I'm just doing it up here. Mm, looks like a house. Those look like deer. And that is like a lake. No, it's a church. Didn't Sarah say something about a church? 
Okay, we got plenty of food around here. My fingers feel numb. And all them cattails. I'm not gonna bother harvesting them up just yet. But there is plenty of food around this. Ah, crap! How do I, how do I get a torch? Torch? Light it? No! No! Oh! Oh, fuck! Ah. I got, I got, I got, I got a laceration, no! Oh, and I got some blood loss. Fuck you! Yeah, go die somewhere! I hope your wolf wife comes and finds you dead! Oh, come on with the wolves! Well, that worked. Okay, sweet. Get my damn torch back. Well, there's a wolf car- or a uh, deer carcass here. So that's cool. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, I'm bleeding to death. How do I do it? Get, do it? Do it? Ah, uh, do it? Oh, oh no. Apply bandits. Don't attack me! Oh, the church looks like it could be a good shot. Oh. Oh. I was like tensing up. Okay, I'm not bleeding anymore, and I'm still at risk. So I gotta get away from these damn wolves. I'm in a graveyard too. So that just makes it worse. Sure, okay, there's nothing around here. I'm gonna go inside. I have a laceration. I don't really know how to treat a laceration, so let's just go to my stats menu. Okay. Uh, okay, so the laceration was nothing. I have a wolf bite that I need to disinfect, and I'm cold. Okay, so let's go ahead and get rid of my risk of infection. We'll use the 38%. Ah, infection risk heal. And I am completely frozen. But hey, I found the church. Can I make fires on the ground? Cannot start campfires indoors. Well, you do that. Really? Someone else did a book. Something to burn. Okay, it is really, really dark in here. I can't see any. Ooh, a bed. Sweet, so I can definitely camp out here. Well, that's a busted up piano. All right, I really need to get some lightage. Uh, I'll start a campfire, even though it's kind of pointless to start a campfire. But hey, I got some books and some cattails and plenty of matches. So I will start a fire, and we will throw this ruined torch on there. Okay. And we will throw the most burnt out torches on there. Okay, so just this one. And then we'll throw a couple sticks on there. There we go, let's get an owl fire. There we go. And then I'll take torch. So I can see. Okay, we've got a wall plaque, some planks. I need a hatchet. No, I don't want a sandwich. I'm just looking around. Cloth, might need to make some bandages. Ooh, is that a soil top? Condition. Sleep restores condition. When your condition gets too low, you start to become dizzy, your vision will blur, and eventually you will lose fine motor skills. This is all a warning that you improve your situation ASAP. Every hour of rest will restore lost condition. You will also gain a bit of condition for every hour you don't get afflicted risks or... Low stats in hunger, thirst, cold, or fatigue. Your status screen can help you keep track of your condition, any current afflictions, as well as help to understand how to treat in injuries <laughs> you may have sustained. Check it often. Well, great, I'm about to pass out. Whoop, whoop. Newspaper. Is that another book? I will take another book. I got it. I'm about to die. Sheesh. Oh, how'd I miss the replay wood? Oh, I saw that. Mine. Oh, sweet. Wooden matches, a book, another book, another book, a blurry book, some, a stack of paper. There's all kind of fire starting material. Much more. 
Okay. I don't have time to read that because I'm dying. I'll take it for later. Maybe I'll read it in another episode. Don't get burned on the fire. Okay. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's see. Where's the torch that's lit? It's gotta be this 3% torch. Let's go ahead and add that. And we will go to sleep. Sun just went down. I will sleep for eight hours. It'll probably still be nighttime when I wake up. But we'll deal with that in the morning. For now, that is all the time I have for this episode. We uh, we got we got pretty far. We didn't do much, but we found the church, and I do believe I'm still on the trail to find the chick in the plane crash with me. Though I haven't seen any more cloth. But following the road is our best bet now, so we're just going to keep following the road. It'll probably, as I said, be nighttime when I wake up. So it'll be a lot colder. Hmm. We'll deal with that when it comes. But for now, thank you everybody so much for watching. And you will see me in the next video. Bye.